Uh, hello, my name is uh, Mirella Mir. I live in East Bali now in Karangasem, but I'm from Jakarta. I am 35 years old. I'm doing abstract uh, painting now. Uh, I call myself as an uh, intuitive painter because I'm doing it intuitively and then I start uh, painting when I was a child, uh, but uh, I start professionally maybe about five years ago in 2017, 7, 16, about that, around that. So I use my painting also as my spiritual journey, you know, because I believe my emotion, you know, sometimes that you cannot talk without talk with. Uh, something so you can just draw, you can just paint. So I think it's uh, the, the the media for me to uh, express because I cannot say it in words. So you know sometimes we are overwhelming with the emotions, something like that. And then I think it's more about daily emotions. But you know when I need to tell a story about my emotion today so I translate it into uh, pieces of my work. We have, uh, it's called Ilu Bali, it's a woman art group based in Bali. So actually it's not only a painter but there's also writer, dancer and then I think it's a collaborative group that we can do something making art together like event exhibition and uh, we now currently we are helping making concept for Ubud Jazz Festival and then uh, also hopefully this year another event and I'm also excited uh, to be part of the healing art community so we also have the collaboration with therapists so it's more about the mental health awareness how art can heal ourselves, something like that. So uh, it's called healing art, uh, healing artwork, something like that. Yeah, yeah, because it's, uh, I live in Israel now uh, for three years, two years, and then uh, actually I have the house here. It's more about the garden house, but because of a lot of my artistic, artist friends come, and then they just want to uh, a place to maybe we can collaborate something and then uh, this house is open for anyone <laughs> who wants to collaborate and then because sometimes we making the exhibition we making the workshop and then also we sharing the workshop with the charity uh, children here because my dad's in law uh, has a charity yeah yeah something that like like charity but you know, it's just nice we are welcome here to open collaboration because I just feel like uh, we need uh, collaboration, you know, with a lot of uh, people from different, you know, sometimes the uh, when you're making film, when you are just doing the fashion thingy, everything, you know, so I'm just open and this place, we also have the Instagram, the social media, we call the so it's like a uh, garden house, uh, friends, uh, so it's open for, for any, it's welcome for any friends. When you come here, we are friends already, <laughs> something like that. <laughs> okay, upcoming uh, project. Uh, this is going to be my first solo exhibition, hopefully this October is to uh, celebrate the mental health awareness. So uh, it's going to be in Jakarta with helping a lot of uh, support from the community, mental health community and uh, friends. So uh, hopefully um, it will be on October. So the theme is also, I think uh, the theme is the color of grieving. So, because I think uh, grieving is part of our life. It's uh, it's not about negative or positive emotion, but it's something that we have to 
realize we have to aware that uh, grieving, how to let go, how to detach, how to uh, you have to healing. I mean, like I want to share that awareness. Like, oh, uh, so maybe people need to feel uh, it's okay sometimes to let go. So yeah, it's more about that. So the detail is that you have to come to my soul. <laughs> yeah.